Now to one of NASA's biggest gambles ever. The space agency calls it seven minutes of terror. Tonight, the Mars rover tries to safely land on the surface of the red planet, but there's big fear any number of things could go wrong. And to borrow a phrase from the Olympics, NASA is hoping to stick the landing. ABC's Clayton Sandell is in Los Angeles with the story. Clayton. Good morning, Bianca. Yeah, you can think of this as kind of a cosmic dismount. In just hours from now, NASA will attempt to earn the gold with the most complicated Mars landing they've ever tried. It's the ultimate mission to Mars that tonight will have all of NASA holding its breath. As the $2.5 billion Mars Science Laboratory hits the planet's atmosphere at 13,000 miles per hour, heating to a scorching 3,800 degrees before a supersonic parachute hits the brakes. Then using a sky crane maneuver never tried before, sophisticated rockets kick in, designed to help lower the Curiosity rover to a precise landing zone, a galactic hole-in-one that requires perfect choreography and no margin for error. NASA describes it as seven minutes of terror, even creating a universal hit with this dramatic viral video, rivaling the best Hollywood previews. If any one thing doesn't work just right, it's game over. Mars has always been a fierce opponent. Of the nearly 40 missions humans have hurled toward the red planet, only 15 succeeded. Mars conquered the rest, 24 spacecraft worth billions of dollars. Mars has been winning. This is the most challenging landing we've ever attempted. But if Curiosity can pull off the upset and survive. I am rationally confident. I am emotionally terrified. The rover will embark on a two-year mission, exploring for new clues about past or maybe present life on Mars. We're explorers, you know, uh, we see a mountain, we want to climb it, see what's on the other side. You know, as scientists, we want to answer the big questions. Now, as you watch NASA mission, mission Control tonight, you may spot a jar of these, peanuts. Turns out it's kind of a ritual to pass them around Mission Control before a very complicated, critical part of the mission. And it's a custom that goes back decades. And with so much on the line, nobody wants to mess with tradition. Dan? Peanuts before and beer after, Clayton, or just peanuts? Just peanuts. All right. You know, I think they'll <laughs> stick with the peanuts for now. All right. Thank you, Clayton.